Hello fellow sim racers, welcome to another Diary of the Backmarker SimGrid series. Today, the Apollo Racing Club invades the SimGrid daily races at Spa Francorchamps. Today, Wright, Saavedra, Thompson, Kimball, and I join the grid. So to get it out of the way, if you enjoyed the video, please leave a like and a comment, which is always more than appreciated. I've linked the SimGrid series so you can join up with us, and I've also linked the treasure 86 who is the person that makes all my liveries in the description spa has always been such a fun track for me even though it's one of my worst tracks it has a lot of tricky turns and who doesn't like playing a rouge radion complex flat i'm going to be frank this wasn't a fun race for me i made a lot of huge errors but always try my best to see a race out the lights go green and quickly we funnel down into the first turn it was such a fun and intense experience especially when everyone makes it out without any trouble I had to get off the gas a little bit to make sure I didn't dive bomb into anyone's rear bumper. After a while, faces are getting familiar and I'm finding myself in a battle with the number 23 Lamborghini of De Leon. I flare out slightly seeing if I can take a peek into the inside of Pulani. Then I manage to get on the brakes a tad bit later and I'm able to steal another spot up the grid and promptly go wide and abuse the track limits. So far the race has been fun as I start to chase down the 52 Ferrari of Paradise. I've always struggled to get into Lasaurus and lately have been working on cleaning up the lines. It does show, but I'm still getting on the gas a little too late and turning too sharp, and not opening up the turn enough. Like I said, I live for the thrill of the chase, and I'm excited to try to get into the fight up ahead, except I forget to account for where Paradise will break at and end up destroying his race. I decide to hang back and not take the free position, it's the least I can do for ramming him like that. We get back underway and continue our race. Getting a much stronger run out of a rouge, I go for the overtake, making sure to give plenty of room. Paradise gets an exit into Lacombe's. I'm glad to be fighting and even more glad that I'm able to prove that I can in fact race clean with someone. We get some great side-by-side -side actions, but once he goes wide at Stavlot, I'm able to take the position back. I do feel a tinge of regret because of the previous incident, but I keep pushing on to catch up to the pack ahead. Huge apologies if you are watching this, and don't worry, karma catches up to me. Clark in the 51 Ferrari has been hunting me down for quite a while, and I can tell he has the better pace. I'm able to hold him off for a few laps by making the Bentley wide and parking on the apex, basically. Once again, I get on the gas too soon and I end up oversteering into Clark and pitting myself, literally. I didn't want to impede anyone else's race and I'm pretty sure that I had a decent amount of damage. That's right, I'll think of this as penance for my past actions. But sitting in the pits is never fun as you watch everyone whiz past you. This is where I thought about quitting the race. I'd be dead last and it would feel like a waste, but I always try to see the race out. Seat time is always seat time, plus I have to make a video too for my adoring subscribers. From behind, I can see the 77 Audi fast approaching me. Just because I ruined my race doesn't mean I should be ruining others. Plus, I'm not close enough to be fighting for position. I intentionally go wide at the bus stop chicane to let him through. The same goes with the two cars fighting it out. I go extremely wide to the point of being off track. I don't want to be impeding their battle. Like I said not too long ago, that I'm nowhere close to being able to fight for position, and no one is close enough to even threaten me. 
So there you have it. Not the most interesting race, but then again, for every banger like Zoder from the previous episode, you'll get something like this. I really appreciate everyone that stops by and watches the Backmarker series. If you're looking for a super chill league to race in, check out the Apollo Racing Club. They have a set of Corsa, a set of Corsa Competizioni, Formula One leagues, rally leagues, iRacing leagues, and if you want more info, it'll be linked in the description. Thanks for stopping by, and I hope to see you on the track sometime soon.